Hello, I am Maddie, also known as Hello Interloper. Um, I wouldn't be making this video right now if it wasn't for my dog, who decided to bark like she was possessed. Uh, I actually have two dogs, although I guess the other one's the family dog. She's 16, she's kind of deaf and blind, and for some reason she likes to bark at absolutely nothing. So, uh, I was sleeping soundly, and now I'm awake, so might as well make a Crash Fever video. So, everybody, it's time for the beach party. Fever on the beach starts today, and it's going to be one hell of a doozy, and I say this because there is going to be some awesome units, and of course, swimsuits. <laughs> everybody likes swimsuits, right? So, limited time quests available. Summer Land K, I believe. Um, so, it's a recovery type. Recover 4,000 HP, convert junk to hearts. Red units get extra tap. Defense high boost for two turns. Heart rate boost. Heart rate is boosted for two turns. Blech. Can be used every eight turns. Massive damage to one enemy and recover HP. Can destroy junk panels and when you get 50 bugs when in front and remaining HP is 50% or less, all unit recovery is boosted by 25%. Pretty interesting. Then we have Summer Cow Cow. Summerland Conqueror Cow Cow. Chow Chow, whatever. Um, he has a magnet. That's pretty damn interesting. And, um, yeah, one panel to a magnet that first attracts hearts, then green. One panel to green color break panel. Then damage yellow, damage and yellow panels are turned into green bombs. And green and heart rate have a high boost for two turns. Very complicated, but he is a technical type, so that's not really much of a surprise. Uh, yellow Dragon Noodles is the crash skill. It's hilarious. Ultra damage to one enemy, high damage to all units, and green unit attack low boost for two turns. He can destroy junk panels, and when in front, destroy 30 panels or more during turn to boost attack. So it seems that, uh, Summer Land K will be used as a healer for... Summer Cow Cow, but that's just my, uh, thinking here. Just like how, um, Happy was used to farm Irwin, even though they didn't have a boost, so to speak. So, there will also be tickets! Uh, and special login bonus as well. Um, the special login bonus actually happened a little earlier than usual yesterday, before the actual event started. And, uh, the title that was given out is Summer. And, uh, I'll show you my title in a little bit. But first of all, let's look at the exclusive packs. They're kind of doing the same thing here that they did with the, uh, King of Fighters thing. Uh, you get stuff, you get lottery tickets. The lottery tickets are basically, like, the tickets that you get from the quests. So, um... They're not really that impressive. You have 30 in your gift box anyway, just to play around with. Um, and then it seems that you get like a special ticket here called the Beach Party Hatcher ticket from the uh, top one. And I'm guessing that's probably going to be exclusive only to the new units. Also, there's a high boost to super success rate during unit enhancements. Now let's take a look at those units from the Beach Party Hatcher A. So, this is the first hatcher. It looks like there's probably going to be two. So, uh, A and B. So we have, uh, Deep Sea Hei Zhangju? Zhangu? Zhangju? Oh my god, I'm so bad at pronouncing these names. So... The Perfect Storm, up to three panels to Super Crash Panel Large, red to blue, timers to crash panels, blue unit attack mass boost, and red panels drop as blue bombs for one turn, can be used every seven turns, and dang, is that a lot of HP, 10,000 HP stamina type. Ultra damage to one 
enemy based off of own max HP is the crash skill. Floor recovery ability, uh, recover 20% of total party HP at end of first turn on all floors, and protect break. Then we have Buccaneer Cheng Zhang Cheng dot <laughs> Zhang Cheng Gong. I think that's how you say it. Oh my god. I'm so bad at this. Okay, so Summer Knife Rush. Uh, hearts to CP. Crash panels. Timers to red bombs. Red unit attack boost for three turns. Absorb yellow and junk to boost it, I guess. Or just absorb yellow and junk in the process. No yellow panels and hearts for one turn. Ultra damage to one enemy for the crash skill. Vaccine. Nice. And then versus dragon damage boost. Boost strength of all attacks when attacking the dragon tribe. Kind of interesting. Uh, fairly high attack, 5,009, pretty good. Then we have Water Slider Guan Yu, who is equal to a festival unit with a cost of 55. Surprisingly sexy. Um, hearts to red, yellow to crash panels, red unit defense ultra boost, chance green drops as hearts, red drops as red bombs, blue as yellow for two turns. Yikes, that's a lot of stuff. And <laughs> it's funny because you see red hair just, you know, in that little water splash there, which is kind of hilarious. And um, yeah, she's popping out of her bikini. High speed water slide is the crash skill ultra damage to one enemy based on own recovery, which is interesting because she's a balance type. Red unit recovery boost for two turns. So this kind of uh, brings up a little bit of a conundrum. What kind of apples to use on her? Because even though her crash skill is dependent on her recovery, her recovery is already pretty high. Um, the crash panel skills are going to be based mostly off of recovery, but it seems that uh, her attack is pretty high as well. I guess, hmm, I guess recovery would probably be the best thing since she does have a crash panel conversion as her skill. But who knows? Ooh, crash panel drop. When in front, low chance blue panels drop as crash panels, but also damage panel breaker. So, that's the Beach Party 10 times ticket hatcher. And, um, looks like... What's this? Beach Party 10 times Hatcher Ticket Required. Oh, I see what it is. Okay, so if you pull three times, you get a Beach Party Ticket. That's the same thing that you would get um, from buying that pack, the, the most expensive one. And that guarantees one swimsuit version. And it looks like Confucius is going to be a... Uh, version 2. Let me just quickly see here uh, if they have a full list of all of the units that are available here. Yeah, okay, so party side B has Confucius, Han, Xianzi, Zhanji, Zhanzi, I don't know. But also uh, Zhang, Cheng Gong. Okay, so that's the difference between party B and party A, but uh, for now we don't really know what Confucius's uh, stats are or Han, but we know Confucius is going to be blue and Han's going to be yellow. So that's what's going on right now with that. Um, if we go to event quests right now, Summer Cow Cow is available for the next two and remaining of today. Uh, Summer Land K is available for 13 days and whatever's remaining of today. We are running out of time for the King of Fighters event. And same thing with Yori. I still need to max him out. I'm getting very close, but jeez, is that an annoying quest to do. I just hate that quest. It's so repetitive and annoying. Oh. I hate it. And, um, yeah, I'm finding that I'm 
totally not doing well in this ranking because so many people have multiple Wigners and there's no chance that I can compete about like against that. But yeah, my title is <laughs> Summer School. <laughs> I, I saw some people um, putting their title as Here Comes a School, and I don't know why that made me laugh so freaking hard for no reason, because it was just so stupid. But uh, as soon as I got summer, I'm like, I have to change mine to summer school. I actually never went to summer school. I did take summer classes in college because they basically had, I think it was two and a half weeks, an entire semester's worth of material in two and a half weeks and you'd get full credit and I'm like I'm not doing anything else during the summer might as well get a class out of the way or two but man I could only handle one at a time because they were so intense I took chemistry and literally that entire month my life was chemistry my entire life it was awful <laughs> I would not recommend it. So, now we have some hatchers. Now that we've talked about all that bullshit. So, I have another spear hatcher, which I'm going to use. And no matter what I get, I'm going to be happy because uh, I already have Gungnir. I don't know why Gungnir is listed here as being a red unit. That's a little odd. Everybody else's uh, unit type is correct on this little infographic. But uh, yeah, I already have Gungnir, so if I get another Gungnir, that's cool because I finally will have the 40 bug ability unlocked. Uh, Trident and uh, Gaybolg, uh, either one is fine with me, so let's pull a Spear Hatcher. Alright, Humpty. Throw me something nice. Alrighty, who's gonna be? Ooh, another Gungnir, okay. I'm alright with that. So I'm gonna get the uh, next version. Cool. Alright, so I am very tempted to use this. Ah, uh -huh. 10 times Hatcher guarantees one Cow Cow or one Lan K. Interesting. And you get a bunch of other stuff, too. So let's do it. Ooka dooks, Humpty. That's a lot of rainbow. This is a new one. Do, do, do. Okay, okay. Awesome. Gonna star that. Because it's six star. Oh, sweet, sweet bits. I need bits so badly. Nice. Oh, interesting. You need 30 tickets in order to pull the 10 times hatcher. I guess it's because you get a chance at a uh, ultimate. But uh, let me just quickly sell off those... Uh, what are they called? Oh my gosh. Golden Ducks. Ooh. That's a lot of bits. I'm gonna need them if I'm going to be... No, that's not what I want to do. Ah! I want to click that. Alright, so now I'm gonna pull the Beach Party Side A Hatcher. Uh, this is really, really uh, gut-wrenching because... Um, who knows? Who knows what I'm gonna get. And I only have uh, 160 polygons left after this, so it's a little scary. Alright. Humpty. Your blank stare shows promise. I hope. Alright. Well, I see rainbows, but that doesn't really mean anything. Ooh, who is it? All right, that's one swimsuit. Deep sea haze eggs. <laughs> I'm not even gonna bother. Ooh, 
different one. Nice! Alright, that's two swimsuits. I'll take it, I'll take it! And thankfully, I have another red unit, because I'm really weak with red. Alright, uh, four star that I don't have. Shoot, who is this? I don't know off the top of my head. Insatiable Mammon. Alright, so she's a max of five star. Eh, whatever. I'll keep it for now. Bunch of bullshit. Whoa, another one? Oh shoot, I got two of that guy now. Alright, so I didn't get Guan Yu, but um that's alright, I guess. Um I can try again later. If I get enough poly. Now, lastly, let's take a look at these special, um, what are they called? Achievements. So, acquire five summer trickster land K, you get five swimsuit tickets. Acquire ten, get ten swimsuit tickets. Fifteen, gig attack fruit, thirty. Three alchemy fruit, fifty. Uh, you get victim. That's a creepy title. Two titles. 70, you get 50 polygon. 99, you get a freaking useless little Humpty. And I say useless because I am absolutely overloaded with little Humpties now. I used to hold them in such high regard and be like, oh, I gotta farm little Humpties. I gotta make more six stars. Now I got so many of them, I don't know what the hell to do. So you get more um, tickets from doing cow cow. And five master keys. Dang, that's nice. Get some titles. Ooh, 70 and you get 100 polygons. That is nice. You also get uh, first clear stuff here. That's pretty nice. All right. So, uh, yeah, polygons. I like polygons. So, in other words, um, going to be a lot of freaking farming to do so good luck to everyone who is taking part in this event i highly recommend taking part in every event just because free stuff but uh yeah this ranker is uh not that great for me um i managed to get an sss ranking and that's that's all i'm really after this time around there's no way i can get within the top 10 just because i only have one wigner but um I mean, my group is so overpowered. I have, I think I pretty much have the top person in my ranking group. Or the, the person who was like in second place or something. I don't know. I got put in a freakishly strong group this time around. I guess you win some and you lose some. But um, the fact that this is a repeat ranker in the sense that, you know, this, there has been this ranker before. So people already have Wigner and they can pull another Wigner. And have two Wigners and have a, you know, advantage over everybody. It really makes it this one difficult for somebody like me who um, doesn't really splurge on ranking hatchers. Anyway, best of luck to everybody with the hatchers, the event, and everything. Keep in mind that if you do not have your uh, King of Fighters dudes maxed, uh, now's the time to do it because two of them are gonna expire at reset at, uh, 2 a.m. EST. Uh, that's Eastern Standard Time, USA. So, uh, yeah, definitely get that done. For whatever reason, Kim is sticking around for another day after that. Don't know why, um, but Kim, you can put on the back burner if you need any of the other ones. So, good luck to everyone and take care.